A day of hunting this week turned into a nightmare. Sunday morning, three local teens were walking through the woods when one tripped. His gun went off. The bullet hit Trent Seymour. Seymour is a well-known ball player in the Spruce City Men's Fast Pitch League. The accident will likely change his life forever. The feeling is indescribable. Just to uh, work all year and go there and achieve your ultimate goal, it, it was amazing. Two months ago, Trent Seymour was celebrating his team's gold medal at the North American Indigenous Games. Now the 16-year-old is in Vancouver General Hospital. A weekend hunting accident has left the athlete without any feeling from the waist down. That was the first thing he said to me when I got to him. But um, he, doesn't, he doesn't know that it may be permanent. So we've been kind of protecting him there. It happened Sunday morning. Trent was out hunting with friends when he was accidentally shot. His friend tripped and dropped the gun and it went off. So you got to be sensitive to, to his friends up there. There were two of them with him and, and the, one, the, the one young fella is um, very distraught at this time and feeling very guilty. The Seymour family is supporting him through this tough time. Former Claydley Tenet Chief Barry Seymour is at his son's bedside. So far, Trent has had two surgeries to repair the damage. He's facing a long road to recovery. It's too soon to say if he'll ever be back on the field playing the game he loves. On Facebook, there's been an outpouring of support. Oh, he's just a great boy and all around great athlete. He's kind to his friends and family and his elders. Family friend Regina Toth has set up a trust account at Integris Credit Union. The cost of living down in Vancouver will, will be an enormous for them. So that donation part will be really um, heartfelt gratitude from the family. Donations can be made at any branch or online. It's all to support the young man who's clearly well-loved. Camille McDonald, CKPG News.